Hey everybody, David Ellison from Megadeth here. Hey, just want to talk to you about the brand new 30th anniversary Rust in Peace five string bass from Jackson Guitars. This instrument is an exact replica of the one bass that I had that we, uh, me and Jackson Guitars, created together back in 1990 for that album right there, Rust in Peace, which is now in its 30th anniversary this year in 2020. And uh, I had one song on that record that I actually recorded uh, with my four string Jackson bass because I was able to drop tune it in the studio, but then we had to go on tour and uh, do a couple of big monumental tours uh, with Clash of the Titans, Judas Priest, Rock and Rio, a bunch of great stuff that we were doing to support that record. And I needed a bass so that I could play just this low D right here in a song called Hangar 18. Um, so that one song set in motion a phone call to Jackson Guitars in the summer of 1990 to create essentially uh, what is now this bass. So as you go down the top from, from the headstock down to the bottom, we've got a five in a line headstock, um, high quality Jackson tuners, which are real smooth and real accurate. We come across a 34 inch scale on this bass. What is very interesting about that is that in order to get the really good tension, the, real, the right punch and pop on any bass, I find the 34 inch scale really works well um, on the first and second strings. However, when you go down to the low fifth string, oftentimes that 34 inch scale isn't quite enough and the notes sound a little kind of thuddy and tubby. But we have actually mastered a great, clean, clear. I got my action real low, so it's, you know, we really got to just kind of stroke the string. But uh, that, that tone is just so crystal clear right there on, on a 34 inch scale with this bass down on that fifth string, which to me is an absolute, just a, it's a masterful, uh, effort that uh, that we put together to create this bass so that you could play 34 inch scale because I wanted a bass, needed a bass back in 1990 that was fast, ripping, shredding, high octane, everything that we expect from Jackson. So now as we go down to the, to the uh, body, it is a neck through, um, so the neck is not a bolt on, it is a neck through which creates a certain kind of tone and quite honestly probably helps that fifth string clarity that we just talked about. We've got EMG PJ pickups, and we have retained the original uh, electronic setup with volume, bass, treble, and a selector switch. So the selector switch uh, up here, I'm, right now I'm up on the, on the P pickup. Which you would expect, that kind of nice, gnarly, good thumping, good punchy tone. Uh, from that pickup. In the middle, you go to both pickups, which creates a nice mid-range punch. And then, of course, when you go to the back, you get all the qualities that you would expect from a J pickup. And as you go down, we have an awesome Jackson High Mass Bridge. We have really mastered this bridge. It is super easy to use, fits the strings through the holes here very accurately. You don't have any problems with any strings getting caught in there. Simple twist of a screwdriver on the fly. This bridge can be easily adjusted and easily intonated. As we flip the bass over to the back, of course, access to the electronics cavity and up here, a nice uh, gate door to access the nine volt battery for the active electronics. So here it is, 30th anniversary of Rust in Peace by Megadeth, that album back there, and the bass that took that album on tour. Uh, for the next couple years after it and even the next record after that countdown to extinction the bass and again I only had one and it had to survive tours and recording But now that bass is perfectly replicated here in this 30th anniversary series bass and it is available to you go to jacksonguitars.com Find a dealer network near you uh, These bases can be obtained anywhere around the world now online everywhere uh, find a dealer near you, pick up one of these bad boys. This is the real deal, and I am very proud to have this base in my arsenal.